I want to go over another document. It is called Life Scenarios. We have to understand that we can't go by the way that we feel. We have to go by the Word of God, not by our feelings. So we have to transition our minds from the natural to the supernatural, to the way of God. So in each scenario here, we are going to learn about the best solution. So let's go to number one. Instead of building your riches in life for this world, solution, plan for your afterlife. Do things which will earn you great rewards. If you go to heaven, constantly pray, give offerings, pay your tithes, bless and help people, help out in churches, counsel people about God, whether it is effective or not, etc. Your life on earth is extremely short. The average life expectancy for this world is 71 years. So there is no reason to put your all in this world. See it as a boot camp. Keep your boxes packed. Wait until you get, you get to your real home. Then you can unpack. Number two, instead of cussing someone out for irritating you, solution, walk away or talk to them in a calm manner. Tell them that they are annoying you. Number three, instead of disrespecting your parents, grandparents, solution, respect and be courteous to them, whether they are wrong or right. God is the judge. He monitors everything. Make sure you are doing the right thing. There is a blessing for respecting your parents, grandparents. Number four, instead of fighting people, solution, walk away. Pray for protection for now and future. Number five, instead of fornicating or committing adultery, solution, different optional choices here. Number one, stay single and totally devote your life to God. Number two, get married and be satisfied with your mate, your spouse. Number three, pray to God to fix your situation. Number six, instead of getting drunk and high, solution, fellowship with people who are goal-oriented. Look for things to do for people. Start a little business to keep you busy to keep you busy. Number seven, instead of going to clubs with the wicked, solution, set up parties and invite holy people. Plan outings with your fellow church members. Number eight, instead of getting depressed, harming yourself or others, solution, start talking positive. Declare positive things upon yourself and others. Find hobbies, large or small. Become more social with others. Stay busy. Number nine, instead of getting jealous or envious, solution, pray to God for wisdom. You must be obedient to God for him to consider slash hear your prayers. Declare that you have all that you need now. Self-employment is in your present in the future. Money follows you everywhere you go. You must declare this. God has enough riches to spread it around to everyone. If they trust him, faith. No reason to be jealous or envious of anyone. Number 10. Instead of researching the latest worldly sinful song and dance, solution. Research the latest sermon taught by a man of God, holy person, based upon the Bible. Read the Bible, little by little. Research songs that lift God up. Songs of praise to God, Christian and gospel. Christian and gospel artists make great music as well. Nice rhythm and melodies. Just go cold turkey off the world. Sinful things. Number 11. 
Instead of watching horror or any other inappropriate movie slash video, solution, watch movies or videos that are mild, something that is tasteful, nothing that is over the line. line. For an example, The Walking Dead, watching stuff like this will create doorways for demonic activity in your life. Number 12. Instead of wasting all your money on personal interest, solution, put God's word to the test. Bless people, give people things that they need, that they need, shoes, socks, clothes, food, etc. Watch God bless you for blessing people. Support churches or anything that promotes God's rules and regulations. Let's stop supporting Satan's supporters, rappers, anyone or anything that contradicts the Bible. So this is the end of the document. I really hope you learned something. God bless.